Yeah, I do like to lift. It's my cat. I'm not <laughs> cutting myself. Don't worry. So not 19, as promised. So this is off center. I scribed it off center, and I scribed this one off center as well, but in the other direction. That's why this one looks insanely not correct compared to this. So uh, fuck you, box. Should have measured this, of course, my fault. But uh, I'm gonna use them anyways. It's not that I couldn't scribe a line or something. I did exactly what I supposed to do, except for measuring this. These are for metal, but I guess it will do wood as well. Doesn't look good at all.
Well, uh, I can't make any aesthetic shots on a table full of crap, and also the fabric is still wet, but um, yeah, it helps making it wet, or at least with a sponge, to get rid of some of the sawdust and uh, some hairs, but this fabric usually uh, has high maintenance to get to to be nice, I mean, uh, very often you have to clean it because it looks faded because of dust and such. But yes, I think this works rather well. Why is it so insanely way too bright? Why is it not doing anything here? So finally, the huh? thing has a problem with adjusting apparently but yeah I think the finish looks uh, okay -ish. I like light wood with uh, dark fabric um, yeah and it works better than the hardwood trims as you've noticed since I made a mistake actually too I didn't measure it before I went making holes and such uh, also it is thinner than this part is uh, and I thirdly so I make third mistakes three mistakes sorry this MDF will expand quite easily if you screw in this direction so having this overlap here is really nice it, it will secure itself in some way. The MDF wants to expand but it can't. So this is by far the, the better way of doing it. Uh, and yeah, it's not that much work. I mean, okay, I had to draw a tiny uh, thing in cut. But uh, yeah, besides that, it's not that much work. So yeah, uh, let's uh, see how it sounds.